despite frantic efforts to save it. A major rescue operation was launched after a bird watcher at Spurn Point spotted the juvenile whale this morning, about three quarters of a mile offshore. Coast guards and mammal rescue organizations reached it, but it was only in about a foot of water, and despite their efforts, it died this afternoon. An investigation's underway after a... Hello, good evening. Welcome to Saturday evening's program. And we start with news that a whale, which had become stranded off Spurn Point this morning, has died. Rescuers have spent much of the day trying to help the sperm whale, which became stuck on mud near Kilnsea. For the very latest, let's cross now to our chief news correspondent, Paul Murphy. Paul. Well, this creature was first spotted at 11 o'clock this morning by the coxswain of the Humber lifeboat at the end of Spurn Point. Um, it was thrashing its enormous tail on a mud flat in the middle of the Humber estuary, about a quarter of a mile behind me. And um, the public and marine wildlife experts descended on the Spurn Peninsula uh, to, to look at this creature. Experts waded out across the mud flats to see if anything could be done for it. Um, but unfortunately, it's about four o'clock this afternoon. Uh, the whale was pronounced dead. Um, Post-mortem examinations will uh, now take place. Experts will be trying to establish uh, why the whale came up the Humber, whether it came up to die, or whether it uh, was driven up by some uh, man-made force. It really is a very sorry sight, and um, when many people here watching on saw the whale and uh, heard it had died, they were very upset indeed. Um, the problem now for the authorities, and we believe it's the responsibility of the local council, is the disposal of this massive carcass. It's about 40 or 50 feet long. It weighs about 28 tonnes. So, so clearly uh, tomorrow's task will be to look at uh, what needs to be done, if anything, uh, to remove this uh, huge whale from the Humber estuary. Back to you. Paul, thanks very much indeed. Now let's look at... The